Good morning. Happy Friday. Hello. Welcome to my channel. I'm Rebecca. Hello, hello, hello. Make a make a nice little hello, Mrs. Gigi. You're good. You're like number one. You get a you get a prize. <laughs> how's your, how you doing today? It's Friday. <laughs> There's Shannon. She she welcoming everybody. Welcome, welcome, friends and family, fellow crackers. That was cute, Shannon. That was cute. This pick a stick day. Are you gonna play today? So I thought that was cute. I don't have many dog things, and and some of y'all make make me feel guilty. I got um, a pumpkin punch and a square punch, which I don't have a square punch. Um, the pumpkin punch was, uh, was just like one of those purchases, but the square punch, that would be kind of a neat little thing, little square. I don't have any, I'm, I'm a crafter and I don't have any paper. And I got some new, um, stamp pads here. New, new to me, they're used. They might need re-inked, um. But they look pretty good. They look pretty juicy. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And they're um they're archival, which I like. Okay, they're gonna stay. So a little bit that I got there. And then um I got a few things um from Rosie, I just love her, her stuff. She has such unusual stuff compared to everybody else. This is a little crocheted, I don't know if it's like this, if they consider it tatting, but I, um, I got some of that. Hello. Oh gosh, I'm gonna get some blood work done. So I have a little bit of that. Hi, K uh, sorry, Kate. KK, I was processing that. I don't know why that took me so long to process. Hi, KK. <laughs> and uh, and this, this though, I know would be considered crochet. So just, this is a, a crocheted lace and ribbon. And um, some lavender, which will go great in my book. We'll use that. Um, Look at these, aren't these pretty? I got this 50 cents for the purple. And then this gray, uh, I don't know. And then some tiny little rickrack, which was a dollar for, it was 10 cents a yard. So I couldn't pass that up, right? So I got some of that. And then I got things that I don't need. Hatkins. Oh my gosh, somebody shoot me. I'm gonna, seriously, for Christmas, I think we're going to pull some out. We're going to use them. What is my problem? Hatkins, they're just so fun to use. Oh, and look, I have some here. This, maybe I want that in a, and that other thing I want. I got some more of the birdhouses. Ooh. That's fun. And I thought this would be a fun one to use for, a you know, doing like a vacation page. These. So yeah, just some napkins that, uh, you know, I don't need. <laughs> but I will use, I will use. Put them up there. All right. All right, and that was about it. So let's get our pages out to do some mixed media. Um, Oh, I'm pressing stuff with my keyboard. I hope I didn't shut you guys down. Go away. Nope. Okay. Woo. Don't do that, Rebecca. Don't do that. So if you're new here and, and, and uh, haven't played along, there's no rules. I'm going to give you prompts. You follow them. If you don't like the prompt, well, then you make your own up and do, do what you want to do. But it's to get you out of your... Um, your the game is supposed to be to get you out of what you normally do. That's what my mixed media is for. So it's not, 
you know, it's not supposed to be what you always do because you can always do that. You can go and do what you always do every day. So today's supposed to make you think outside the box, do something a little bit different, what you're not used to doing and um, maybe learn a new trick or two, maybe learn. I can't find my mixed media book, guys. I pick up cleanup and I can't find my mixed media book. <laughs> Where could it be? I mean, it's pretty thick. I couldn't have moved it too far, guys. Um, so yeah, that's what that's what my games are supposed. To, that's what Fridays are supposed to be to kind of um, get you out of your old routines of the same type of arting or crafting that you do. Help you learn how different mediums work together or don't work together. Sometimes that happens too. And just have fun and just have fun. Okay, where could it be? Who stole it? Although I thought someone stole my cat book and we that came about. So it has to be here somewhere. But where, where would I, where would I put that so that I wouldn't lose it? It's a big book. There's my cat book. There's my everyday book, my tag book, my Happy Meal book. Everything is right there. Oh, it's in the spot where I was thinking I would uh, start keeping my books. <laughs> so it's kind of where it's supposed to be. I did. Oh goodness, this whole this whole arthritis thingy that's going on with my thumb has really given me I can't even pick this book up, guys. That's crazy. My hands were my strongest things the last eight years because of you know this book. Jeez. I couldn't even pick that book up. Couldn't even pick it up. <laughs> Good morning, Mousy. Get your coffee, honey. Get your coffee. I even got myself a kalanchi here. Got coffee, a kalanchi, scissors. I'm ready to go. <laughs> hey, Brenda. But, well, that's that is that's gonna make it so that you can be creative, <laughs> Brenda. How's your hubby? How's he doing? Where's Allison? I mean, we need to find out how Allison's Allison's daughter's doing. Okay, my hair pulled up. Let's find a page. Let's find a page to play in. See, that was last week's. Not that great. But it's a page. Not the favoriteest, but it's a page. And go ahead. If you don't have gesso, that's okay. If you only have a piece of crap, girls, I do. A, I do uh, art when I'm, you know, like if I'm watching when I'm, I like do Beth Schuller's art. And I grabbed my Medicare book that was sitting next to me on the on the on the table. You can do that too. Just grab whatever's there. Mm. Yum. Just grab what you got. I, it's it will be great. It will be fun. And if it's not the greatest and it's not that fun, that's okay. We always have next week. Doesn't have to be a great picture. Some of that I can actually shake that around. I, I, when I got that, I thought, huh, I will never use all that. There is no way. Well, here we are. It has been a while, it's been over a year. And if I and if I did my mixed media as often as I used to, it would be gone, but I don't, I don't, I work in so many different things stream with you guys. I don't seem to, 
be in my art journal books as much. Get those toothpicks out, girl. Get you going. Hey, where's Candy? Hopefully she's okay. She, hopefully she's uh, just win her paper. She usually plays. Who's playing today? Who's got their piece of paper out? All you need is a piece of paper and pencil. We'll figure out, we'll, we'll take the rest from there. Or pen or marker. Even if you're at your office, we'll figure it out. Tell me what you got. We'll figure something out for you to play. You can hide it from your boss. I won't tell. Oh, Candy said give her a few minutes. <laughs> I am here. I'm looking for my mushy crayons. All right. Hey, Amy, you going to play some mixed media with us? Some pick a sticks? Come pick some sticks. Or you can pick your nose, whichever. Have you guys picked out a contractor yet? Oh, well, don't try to organize. I couldn't even find my book because I was, Gigi's like, let's get this roll. Let's, Gigi's ready. She was the first one here today. She even beat out candy. Here's my little thing. I keep pushing around. I, there's a little plastic thing that I put on there. I guess not no more. It's just under there. I have even cat toys recyclers. For crafting. Hmm. Oh my goodness. Meow. Meow. Come here, Storm. Meow. 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 Holy cow, I could buy a house for $6,700. Go out and buy one of those little houses. Janie, put it in your in your driveway. If you don't, do you have a yard? If you don't have a yard, put it in your driveway for that much. You could have your own little she shed. She he shed she shed. For shares. For serious. I'm gonna take a bite of my palanche. I have a huge, it's probably a 300 square foot. No, it's probably bigger than that. Shed. And it, the problem is though, it's at the corner of my property. And I can get there. Well, right now I'd be going through you know, knee high grass, but um, it's not. It's, oh, the deer are in the yard, the mama and the baby. It's, if they stop, if they come towards the house. This is, a, she has two babies. I, I thought she just had the one. Oh, this is the herd. There we go, there's the herd. That's a big They're just moseying on through, aren't they? <laughs> she hears you, Mousy. Shannon's on the back porch with Jug. Look at this, guys. There's Jug laying there watching him. You see him laying there on the on the deck. Mm -hmm. 
He's just laying there watching. This is just one. We have three different types of deer that come through. Those are the axis. We have um, antelope. I guess they're not, they're not deer. We have antelope that come through. The antelope like to bed down in the front yard and sleep. I think, what did we count? There were 16 of them the other day. They, they didn't stop to eat because Shannon's out there, I bet. Well, and Jug. <laughs> what a good boy. There's a mama and a baby standing there. Shannon must have made a noise. Was it 13 the other day? Oh, but that was with the big daddy. Big daddy wasn't in that group. I don't know where he's at. Jughead did so good. He didn't bark or anything at him. What a good boy. There's still two still standing out there, real still. <laughs> oh, yeah, maybe, maybe candy, yeah. We were looking at that mama because the mama and the baby, well, mama and the two babies, one of the babies was almost on our porch. See where Jug is right now? She was like right there on eating grass big. She looks like she's going to pop with another one. Oh, now I've done it. Now my cord fell. Now I might get a picture of my own kid here a second, guys. Uh oh, hold on. Okay. <laughs> here we go. A little closer, too. <clears throat> that was neat. <laughs> I see those babies. Oh, I think Shannon tried to kill me. She soup the other day. No, it wasn't soup. It was stew. And uh, she she like uh, didn't tell me how hot it was. I burnt my tongue so bad. I thought I was going to die. Now he's wa now he's walking back there like he's going to check out where they were. That's funny. He's back in that tall grass sniffing around like, hmm, what were these guys? <laughs> Okay, are we ready? Should be. It's 20 minutes. We're going to say. All right, so we have seven, which we found out seven really wasn't a good number. Maybe I should roll three. Maybe I should roll three dice, guys. What do you guys think? Real quick. Should we do seven or should I roll? Should I start this week and try three dice and see where that gets us? We know five doesn't give us enough prompts. Seven is right there at that, like when I used to do 10 prompts, or do you just want me to pick 10 prompts? Let's just pick 10 prompts. We'll stick the cat dice. We're gonna do 10. Mrs. GD says three. Oh, okay, let's just do that because that would take us up to a heck of a lot of prompts if we get three sixes. Let's hope we don't get three sixes. Here we go. We'll do three. Ten. Well, there we go. Ten. I'll pull out ten. I was going to pull out ten anyways. How perfect is that? Seven and a couple of turns. Okay, here we go. 
um, one, four, four, five, six, seven, eight, digging, digging deep, digging deep, one, Love that one little bell on there. Okay, let's see. If let's see what we can do with these. Your favorite color, purple. A playing card. Use a stick. Any even to stir up your paint. Some buttons. If you don't have anything, just let me know. We'll figure something out. Add some texture. You can use texture paint. You can use your play and put. And the playing card on there is going to give you texture. Anything that lifts your something onto the paper that when you touch it, you feel it. Paint, color pencils, holy cow, got a lot going on here. Oh, got some tissue paper. Stop, you're done. <laughs> and uh, words. So this must have been, let me pick another one because I, that was for a different game. That was for when we were picking them one at a time. There we go. Uh, oh, add some flat backs. My goodness, what do we got there then that, that we, we've got paint, we can do a lot with paint, your tissue paper. So those are nice backgrounds. The stick you can use to color with, to draw with. You can glue it on if you want. Playing card, my favorite color is purple. I was going to try to do something for the holidays so I can do holiday cards, um, but um, um, I decided. I decided against that, so I'm not doing that. I'm, like, I'm bubbled here. This one's a little flatter. Oh. Um, okay, so here we go. What are we going to do? What are we gonna do today? I have the oh, I have playing cards sitting right here. Any of these? Any of these tickle my fancy? Those are not these cute birds. Okay. Oh, you aren't here. I don't think you're here, Mousey. Do you have this card? Oh, um, sorry, tissue paper, words, flat backs. Oh, oh puppy. Yes, we watched and we watched how well Jughead sat on the porch. Yeah, we I videotaped it or not video, I yeah, streamed it. Oh. Yeah, he was so good. He did, and he did. Did he try, or no. he just seen him coming? And you did you have to tell him to stay, or no? I just started recording, and he just sat, sat there, there, just watched him go by. Such a good boy. You were a good boy. You Those are friends, huh? Yeah. He sits at the door too and uh, watches them. Watches them. They say hi, Shannon. Hi guys. She got home at eight last night this morning, so she's. Wrapping down her day. He's such a good boy. He's just like, hey, what are those things coming through our yard? Um, I'm coming over here to get oh, some playing cards. Sakes. For goodness, goodness sakes, my wheelchair is catching. I have to figure out a different, I can't have everything plugged into one plug. I mean, that just is not a very smart, safe thing. And I just don't have another plug that's close besides the one that I have to drag my um, cord across the floor. The cord going across the floor usually doesn't bother my wheelchair. 
it's the cord that comes from the floor to the, the table, my heat gun cord, that seems to catch my wheelchair all the darn time. Or I guess my wheelchair catches it. All right, playing card. If you have one, if you don't have one, you don't have to use it. I don't know, it doesn't matter. I'm thinking I wanna use like whatever I come up with here, that's kind of be my, my basis, I think is what's what I'm thinking. That's why I'm looking for that first. Love this little girl. She's got purple on and that's my favorite color. Maybe we'll use her. Do you have a friend? I don't know if there's another, I know I have more of her. I don't know if there's a compliment to it. Do you want a little doggy to hang out with? That kind of works. Um, there's a little, bet you that's the compliment the deck, you know, the canasta decks or whatever that have the two decks. Oh, this one's great. Let's see, let's see, let's see. All right. Okay. I also seen someone that did something really neat with the numbers, which I just thought about that. That might be kind of neat. And I have some cards here that, let's see. The ones I really don't care about. I'm gonna kind of just toss. Let's see, I guess them. I'll have to get this to one of those first ones. Oh, that's an ace. I'm not looking for an ace. Okay. I think I had a whole stack here. I thought I did. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. These are the ones. Those. Oh. This one is a sign. Threes, fives. It's an art picture. It's kind of neat. Okay, just gotta, 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 gotta give me a minute. Those are kind of neat. I'm getting ready. You guys usually are done before I'm even. I'm even getting going. Okay, here we go. Let's see what I can come up with. Let's see what I can come up with. I still need, what do I need? Tissue paper. I can do need some tissue paper. Some tissue paper. Oh, O and T. You know, that big box is marked tissue paper. Is it blue? It's behind me. It's not blue. It's not blue. It's green. Tissue paper? This is right on top. Here we go. My favorite color. Blue, pur blue, blue, purple. Purple. I do not have purple. Because I moved all my paints They're over here. Please don't fall off again. I will fall away straight. Okay. This purple. And 
help us move. Get the heck out of here. Get the heck out of here. Okay, here we go. And That. I'm just gonna pour it. That's just gonna make a mess. Where's my where's my pokey thing? Are you all done with yours already? Are you all ready to move bigger, better? Oh, hey KK, did you you didn't go get your blood done already? Did you? This is all up in my face. I can't see the. So I'm going to use the card to paint with too. So I might not stick stick cards on. We'll see. We'll see. Maybe I'll just use it to paint with. This sounds like there's either very little in here or it's a clob. I guess we'll see. Oh, that's dried. I don't know. It's, it's all still good. It's all still good. I love these two colors together. Love them. They're what they're these are glob. Okay, I guess I could have left that glob and that would be my texture too. <laughs> That's my texture too. Hi Dawn. We're doing some pick a stick mix media. You can play along if you like. There's my creation. Sweet more. So far, so far. Oh, me too. These are my two favorite. I don't know if they're coming across on you, but it's like a, a grapey purple. And this, so it's like, they call it purple pansy and kiwi. That's what they're calling them. My two favorite colors to work with together. And that was one of my things, favorite color. Very person. So there we go. And I used a card, a playing card. I don't know if I'm gonna stick one down or not yet. Or use um, you know, use a card. I may I have some ideas. Paint, use up here, use them up here. December daily. Question: What it like? What exactly is the December daily? You, I hear that every number people doing their December daily, but you don't hear them saying, "I'm doing my August daily," or my July daily. But you hear December daily all the time. So is it different? Is it is it is it because December is usually such a stressful month? Why is there like specifically a you know December daily per se? All right. Um, you stick. I read that is bathroom. Why? Maybe I have to use the bathroom. Some subliminal uh, 
whatever. So it's a little uh, suggestion of the bathroom, maybe. I don't know. Let's see. Okay, there's my tissue paper. Let's see what I want to do with it. Maybe do some crunching up. Put it down. I gotta think what else I'm gonna do with the rest. Gotta do some colored pencil somewhere too. So if I do like crunch it up when I'm pressing, you know, before I glue it down and give me some really cool texture. When you want something to crinkle, it doesn't, but when it, you're trying to keep it flat, it's like you can't get it to behave. Something like that. It's kind of cool, I think. It's already sticking there, don't stick there. Put it up to the top. Yes, I'm thinking. I'm thinking now. Yeah. Okay, let's glue that down. I'm not quite sure. I know that some people do a different prompt to use Christmas Eve. Interesting. Okay. Well, then that, I think you and I are on, kind of on the same, like, yeah, same kind of. Oh, my goodness. Unbelievable. My hand strength is just absolutely gone. Oh, I thought I was going to have to resort to a different glue. Gonna have to see if that's a paintbrush in the coffee. Oh, I feel my wheelchair back. I feel like I'm like sitting in the other room trying to reach my desk. 49 dragonflies. Inter I don't know her. She got she got, she got some juices that you can use to get flowed. <laughs> Interesting. Write that down, guys, so we have it. 49. Dragonflies. Where's Allison today? Gosh, I hope she's okay. I hope her daughter's okay. Oh, look at that texture. Oh yeah, I love me some texture, guys. Love me some texture. I'm a texture girl, <laughs> not a material girl. I'm a texture, I'm a texture girl, living in a texture world, texture. I love to pet my, my journals, my, uh, my art journals when I'm done. <laughs> Every page I rub my hand across. Makes me happy. Makes me want to do a happy dance. I don't know, do I want to, oh look, I missed glue right there. That's okay. I was gonna put it, I was gonna go over, I guess I'll, I won't do it real thick. I'll just maybe do some of it because it needs to be, I don't want it to be too loose here. Do a little bit, not real heavy glue, just maybe a real little, like a little bit of glue on some of this. Put the glue, put the glue on the brush. There we go. Get you some glue up in there. Tissue, it doesn't take much to stick tissue paper down, just saying. 
Doesn't take much to rip tissue paper either. Put the tissue paper on the page. Oh yes. All right, I'm digging that. Digging it with a with a two by four. Oh, no one digs with two by fours. Maybe it's a new way of doing it. Any foremans out there? Try digging with a two by four and let me know how it works. All right, got the tissue paper done. Let's give it a little dry. That's what I'm thinking is um, maybe she's with her. Well, her daughter was supposed to be this weekend too, I think. So um, that might be. What else too? Who knows? Who knows what, with all these all these crazy people at this time of crazy of the year. You never know. People are mean to go shopping. And although it is COVID year. I don't know if anyone's going to do anything. Okay. Let's fight with my, my wires. Who knows what everyone's doing. I have to check with her. Is she Maybe a little. Oh, oh. Now, come on now. My screen. With the little birds. I usually have a cat. They haven't gotten around to getting my cat one up there. Thought I'd use that one for a little bit. Flat back words, buttons, buttons. Who's got the buttons? Buttons, buttons. Who's got the buttons? Okay, buttons. One true purple button in there. It's because I'm, I, that's because I don't buy the like cheap button, plastic new new buttons. That's the word I'm looking for. I buy more of the, I buy all my ant, my buttons come all from like those antique kind of, what do they call Vintage, vintage buttons. There we go. Geez, I couldn't figure out the words. I was trying, trying to say words were not coming out of my mouth. No green buttons. I do have these new buttons I got the other day. They are green. And blue. And purple. They're really old. They would make it very hard to. Oh my gosh, dang That's gonna get fixed. That's driving me nuts. Hey, whoever I bought this from is from Texas too. Let's see these buttons. They're very old and chipped up and take the shanks off of them. They're ceramic. Interesting. Oh, there's some purple buttons. Oh, too. One, two, three. Easy as the raining. Why is the coffee done already? I did use this little girl. Hmm. 
Let's get those shanks off. Yeah, she was. Yeah, she was, KK. But you know kids. They're crazy. That was crazy. I can't. This shank is like, I was made in the 70s. I'm not coming off. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay, one. That hit me in the head. Ready? I think I need both hands. Two. <laughs> Get ready. That, the, that little piece hit my window. Get ready. Now, hopefully, I can find. Okay, that one's there. Okay, so let me find the other two. One went in this box. I think. Oh, that's not how there it is. Okay, there it is. And the other one's over here on the floor. Those other pieces, the, the, the shanks will get back in up eventually. <laughs> words in my hair. I don't know what hit me in the head, if it was a shank or if it was a button. Okay, so we got, got these three buttons. We got her. She's kind of cute. Orange or the blue? Ooh, the orange or the, I think her. Purple goes with the purple background. something on my hand. While I'm looking up at my punches. I'm thinking about punching, like do a little punch on the bottom here. What little punch could I do? Lump, butterflies, butterflies. Hmm, oh, I have those little flowers. Those little flowers might be cute. Let me get, let me get that one. and put this chair here for her cat <laughs> so her cat could sit up here and her cat's not even here and the cat's not even here looks like. Very straight, Rebecca. Hey, Tammy. Does not like this card. Says it. It's too thick for me. The blades. 
That's the trick once you get it stuck. Come on, get it out of there. Hey, Sherry. How do I get it to release, guys? Uh, sure, yeah, thanks. I got my punch stuck. What are you doing? Well, I got my punch. I, it's stuck. You want to say hi? What are those? Those are buttons. Oh. Come on, you want to say oh. Did you decorate them buttons? No, they're from the Bon Ton in oh. Toilet, the 80s. Oh. Hi, Gail. Hello, hello. How do I get it? Because Well, I know it's because of this card. It was too thick. How do I get it out of there? How? Come on. Come on now. Your other spare messy bedroom so I can't put this punch on there. That would, well, okay, there we go. There's my mixed media for the day. Oh, yay, yay. I need some coffee for this. <laughs> what you watching? The Kid Nazis. The Kids Not, the Kid Nazis. Oh, like a history Doctor, channel? Yeah. Interesting. We were just talking about that the other day. It was sad. It's oh, sad. It is. Well, of course it's sad. Of course it's sad. Thing for you to be ah watching. Okay, was that worth it? <laughs> Getting those flowers on there, yes, because it looks cute. It was worth it. All right. Note to self: make sure you're using a nice, nice, strong, sharp punch to go through cards. <laughs> Who Jughead? Because you fed him din dinner twice yesterday. Janie, I threw it on the floor. It still didn't work. That's I have a real big one that sticks sometimes, and that's how I get it. That one I throw it on the floor. I draw. I mean, it's carpeted. If it was wooden, I wouldn't do that. It might hurt my floor. I know. Look at everybody coming in and saying hi. You guys are wonderful. Wonderful. Fabulous. Is my speaker working? Oh, yeah. Do you want another Kalanji? Uh, no, I don't know if I finished this one. It. Yeah, it's gone. I ate it. I just said I wasn't sure if I finished it. Okay, I think that's... I, I'm, li I'm kind of liking this guy's spare for Jalen. in very 70s. Very 70s. Wish this was... Wish that was a little bit... Wish that was a little bit shorter. Wish it was a baller. These are all, and I don't think that. I mean, those are like from nineteen. You know, those are like made really well. So my fingernail file probably is not going to file that down like my the plastic ones that I use. Put a hole in my I'm filing down the. A button. Oh yeah, it's found it down. It'll take forever. Okay. Up there. Over here. I'm really liking you. You're cute. You're number three. All right. Got the buttons. Stick. Ooh. Tammy sent me some colored sticks. Where are they? Right here. I'm not going to use them yet, so they are going to come in handy. Yes, they are. Like, I sent this to you to use for, for the stick game. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay. 
Yes, look at that. How pretty, 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 pretty. Okay, I'm gonna have an idea, I'm gonna break them. I got plenty here if it doesn't, if it doesn't come to my satisfaction of what I'm, what I'm trying to accomplish. I know Prancer and Dancer and something and Vixen, Comet and Cupid and Donner and Blitzen, but do you recall the most famous reindeer of all? Do, 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 do. Rudolph the red nosed reindeer had a very shiny nose. And if you ever saw it, you'd say it was all oh, the other reindeers used to laugh and call him names. They never let poor Rudolph join in any reindeer games. Then one shiny, nope, it wasn't a shiny. Then one foggy Christmas Eve, Santa came to say, Hey, Rudolph, with your nose so bright, won't you guide my sleigh tonight? He said, No, I won't, because you were not nice to me when I wanted to play the games. So go blow it out your nose. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle bells, right? Jingle bells, and I see we need at least the words, I think, because I don't know what it's. How about that? And we'll do one, we won't we'll do that, and then we'll do three. It's supposed to be green. Why are you acting here so tight? Because I'm taking it out of the moment I didn't already hear you. Big dummy. You big dummy. Okay, favorite Christmas movies, guys. I'm, I'm going to be a little bit smarter with these. There we go. Um, favorite Christmas movies. How about, here's a favorite classic Christmas music and favorite, like, uh, M more modern Christmas movie. How about that? Because there's definitely, you know, you have the older ones that are just hollow, and then you have the oh, Drummer Boy. Is that a classic? I'm guessing. I don't know it. I mean, that's a song. I know it's a song. You're not saying sing. That's my favorite Christmas song. I have zero tune or whatever, and I sing to you guys all the time. I'm your singer. Looky, looky there. I'm digging that. I don't care what you guys say. You can't tell. You don't know me. 
Um, can't, have two, can't have two shorties in a row. What are we saying again to Mousy? Someone ran the gram over with the reindeer when she was coming home from my house Christmas Eve. You might say there's no such thing as Santa, but as for me and Grandpa, we believe. <laughs> the twelve. Uh, uh, what is it? The seven days at at uh, deer camp or whatever that cracks me up because <laughs> that is so true up around my house. I'm sure for anyone that hunts and, and all that understands that totally. It's hilarious. Hilarious. My great my great grandpa. He used to come up to the house with my grandpa and my dad, and my mom, and go hunting. And I came home from school one day, and grandpa scared me today he was sitting in the house he was supposed to be out hunting he was sitting in the house sleeping <laughs> it scared me almost to death it was hilarious i screamed i jumped i was like oh oh pap i'm sorry because i of course scared him too well kids i have <laughs> so i didn't know you were in here said you get i asked him i said did you get a deer <laughs> no Nothing was out there, so I came back in. <laughs> mm -hmm. You mean you needed a nap? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, she does. Poor grandma. I know. She. Granny the drunk. All right. Let's, let's glue these. Let's glue these babies down. Wish me luck. They, they stick. They'll, they'll stick. Rumpity dump dump rumpy bump bump look get frosty go. Rumpity bump bump rumpity bump bump over the hills of snow. See, I need, I don't know the beginning. I just know what's that called the, I mean, I probably know them. I just can't come up with it on my own. <laughs> Rumpity thump thump. <laughs> I'll sing it however you want me to see. You want me to sing it thumpity? <laughs> Bumpity, humpity, humpity, hump, hump, humpity, hump, hump. Look at Frosty go. <laughs> oh my, Frosty. This is not a children's channel. This is today channel for adults only. Even it warns on here. He's like a mini adult. <laughs> adults only. Do not make videos for children's. Go watch Barney. Like it matters. I don't have I'm not to I'm not to the point where I have to worry about it anyways. I'm not making no there's no ads on my channel. You have to start really worrying about that with the ads. That's what it's all about. Just to make sure that children are not getting all those condom ads at the beginning of their, of their videos. So if you have your thousand viewers, guys, you have to be careful with that. That's, that's, you have to make sure that uh, you 
you're following those those guidelines because you could get in some big trouble. Once you start getting those ads on your a lot more responsibility with your channel. Not on me. <laughs> never. I never. If I get to a thousand people, I'm scaring people off. Go away. Nobody wants you here. Not you. I like you. But you other people, go away. <laughs> To go get all my game of friends. Say, quit following me. You don't watch me, anyways. All right, here we go. Got the buttons down. I wonder if I could consider those flat backs. Baby snowballs. <laughs> oh, baby. Okay. Button sticks like that. Flat packs and words. All right. Colored pencils. It's so funny, I don't hardly ever use colored pencils and this is two times I used them last night and now I'm using them now. Crazy. So I say crazy. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Where is Carson's voice? KK, take care of you.
And there we go. Is everybody else done? I feel like I've been done for 20 minutes, Rebecca. I'm not, hey, I'm not that much. We only started 20 after. How'd I do? Did I do okay? Did I do okay? All right, so we got favorite color, which is purple back here in my background. Uh oh, oh. Well, that's heavy with those beads on there, or with those buttons. Got the purple in the background, the playing card, the paint is the background. Texture is this lovely, oh, there's texture all over the dang place. Tissue paper for texture. Use stick. Oh, and I use the playing card to spread my paper paint too. Use sticks, right there, I'll use some sticks. You could use sticks to spread paint if you wanted to. You can use sticks to uh, draw with, paint with. You can glue them down, mix your paint with it and say you used it. Buttons, these are my buttons. Color pencil, always smile. Use words, always smile. And flat back, I have put some flat backs on there. So there we go. Thanks, Donna. I'm gonna bring y'all down instead of bringing you out. There we go. Done. Candy's done. Here's a four. Did you post? I can share if you post it. My desk isn't that messy. Though it's not that organized anymore either. Not that messy. Tell you what. If you guys don't have one of these and do mixed media, you need to get these 88, I think 88 cents at Walmart. I use these more than I realized I'd use them. Also, I use a rough grit nail file. One, for when I break my nails when I'm craft, crafting, I can use it. And two, I use this darn thing to file down stuff all the time. So that's another little handy thing to have in your craft room. If, if I mean, if you do mixed media. You just never, never know what you're gonna end up needing to cut and file and all that good stuff. Just two little things that you don't, you know, not normally have, would think to have in a craft room, I guess. Look at me putting stuff away, putting stuff away because it makes so much. Excuse me, that was a coffee burp. That was kind of gross. Sorry. I share everything with you guys though. Okay, everybody have the, the oh, I should take a picture. Look at me remembering this week. Look at me remembering. Snap, go me. Now to post it, that's that's a problem. Remembering to post is usually an issue. I don't know you guys how close of a picture you guys get. Always smile. Bam, bam, bam. No reason not to. Life can always be worse, guys. Always. Did you get in there for 
next week. Oops. Bye, guys. See you next week. Bye. Bye, Mom. I'm your favorite stick, aren't I? Yes, you are, honey. You're my favorite stick. Okay. So we have the draw. I'm really wanting to make this into a cat book, guys. Like, I am really wanting. But I think this might be kind of hard to do on screen. It's kind of little. I mean, the bears are cute, but just not as cute as a cat book would be. I just have to figure out. Because these are little signatures. Like, that's a signature. I guess what I would do to take out pages because there's only four there's not very many one four that's oh they're they're sewn in ah <gasps> they're sewn in so i could take those out pretty easy snapperoozies because i don't think what i want to do it's going to be real Thick. Like I'm not, it's not going to be, a th it might be. I have a lot of little cat stuff. But I mean, how can you get over that little heart and then not open this up and have cats in it? <laughs> how could that be? How would that not be normal? How is there 115 pages in here? Holy cow, 125 pages. That's, that's craziness. Oh, done posted. Okay, hold on. We, we need to see paint. Let's see candies. If you're not part of the group, good. No. <laughs> we don't want you there anyways. Um, it's all, oh, you did credit. You did a holiday one. Candy did a season's green. Good job. Is red your favorite color? Very pretty, Candy. Very pretty. Very pretty. Gosh, is, is this a real flower or is that texture? Because I cannot, I cannot tell. That's, that's like tissue or something, isn't it? You just added, did you add glitter or something to make it look 3D? I mean, it looks 3D to me, for sure. Very nice. Thank you for posting. Thank you for posting. Okay. So, I if I maybe take out one, nowhere better to start than the, the beginning. If I take out one folio, per signature, that would probably, don't hate me if you're a bear lover and I'm taking this book of art. Cats roll, bears drool. Okay. Let's take one out. Each one, let's see what. I feel like an old lady. I have my, can you see it? I have my dang glasses on the bottom of my nose because I have to use my glasses to see far away to read what you guys have. <laughs> the hard thing is it's so little fun in the darn pages. One more. Nope. Okay. I'm trying to make sure I don't rip that, break that sewing. It looks like it's a pretty well-made book that I'm tearing up here, which I hate to do. I hate doing that kind of stuff, guys.
Oh, look at you guys. Aren't you cute? So near to be a cat. I'm gonna stick cat heads on all these beards. <laughs> I'm gonna go through them. Stick a sticker on top of all their heads. I'm not a teddy bear hater, guys. I'm not. I just think I could put this book to better use. Death to not like glitter. Devil's tears. There you go. It's Friday, man. Friday. Friday. Friday night in the big city. We're gonna decorate the tree. Okay. Let's see, oh, anyone want the little teddy bears? Oh. Oh, look at all these little teddy bears. Dollar, 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 dollar. dollar. Give, me, give me two dollars. Give me two dollars. Anyone got me two dollars? Two dollars for the teddy bears. Yo, it's two dollars. I'll even throw this one in. We're starting the bidding off at two dollars. What, what do you? Oh my God! <laughs> Anyone want the little the pages that I tore out? There's probably going to be more too. Let's get all these. Anyone doing a teddy bear book? Now I can't guarantee you're going to get these anytime soon. Just saying, it might take you me a couple or three months or four months or five months, but. If you have a teddy bear fetish, let me know. If you don't, I'm gonna sell them in my next sale for two dollar and fifty cent. A buck two eighty. Are y'all teddy bear haters like me? No, I'm not a teddy bear hater. Let me tell you, anywhere else on the internet. All those sales you guys go to, they'd be selling these for three and you guys would be jumping on it. Put in your next me. I'll sell these four teddy bear pages for a dollar. And y'all would be saying me. Y'all know it. I know you would if you were over there on all that because they would be talking them up about how they're, you know, so precious and they got these little hearts and you can do this with it and you can do that. I know you guys. Oh, Donna, I'm not selling them to you, honey. You, you love teddy bears? You want them? They're free. I'm not selling them. Teasing. They're free. The sign said free to Donna. But if you'll pay me a buck to 80, I'll sell them. Are you trying I'll, to be an auctioneer? <laughs> I'm trying to sell these pieces of teddy bear that I just ripped out of this book. I'm, I'm sending them to Donna uh -oh. for a buck to 80. She's going to send me a buck to 80. Cashier's check. And I expect the payment in 24 hours. Right, Shannon? Uh huh. <laughs> no, not really. Yeah. Oh, I I'm putting it in here. Donna. And look, isn't this what they would do? They'd say, Donna, I'll send you a bill. No, you're not going to pay me. You're silly. No. But I do need your address. That's why I said, no, that's silly. <laughs> no, that's silly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'll, I'll probably add more because I need to pour, pull some more out of this book. I'm turning this little bear book into a little kitty book. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be cute. It is gonna be cute. With these stupid bears. No offense, Donna. <laughs> Sounds good. Do you you have me on Facebook? You can find me on Facebook. Well, I don't know if you can find me. on. You should be able to find me. Are you part of our group? Okay. If you join the group, then you'll be able to find me. Yeah, I can't find no one on Facebook. So, <laughs> Especially I'm just Rebecca on here. Yeah. And Create with Becca's. Well, I mean, if you look it up, I guess. I wouldn't be able to find it. Well, it's Create with Becca. Get it right, Shannon. Look, I'm not on, I'm not on StreamYard, so it doesn't say it down there in the corner. I don't even know what I'm doing. Oh, oh, I was tearing this out. So I think that might even still be too many. I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to take out one more. I mean, because there was a hundred, let's see what it says. 
125. So I took out, I don't know, a few. Close it again, let me see. That's a lot of pages to fill up with kitty cat. I mean, I have enough kitty cat stuff. I don't know if I have enough little kitty cat. I have a lot of stamps though. Mm -hmm. Well, I could do a stamp on each page. You do have a lot. You can okay. do it. Yeah, I just need to gesso all these pages. Not all of them. Well, yeah, because no matter what, I'm going to cover it up. I'm not going to keep a teddy bear story in here about a cat with cats in it. That's a lot of pages, Shannon. Hmm. So we'll take out some more cute pictures of teddy bears. I could take out this one whole signature, this center one. Well, you take out mess up the center. No, because it, they're sewn in. Mm -hmm. So, oh, look at that that hole. Let's see if I can get this out without ripping the folio too bad. Fun. I don't think so. Okay, not too bad. Sounds good. Sounds good. Sounds good. Oh, he's cute though. I'll take him out for me. <laughs> I'll have no pages left because I'll be like, oh, look at this bear. You want him too. They'll, all of a sudden, I'll have to be making all new pages for my book. Is that dog in the window? Woof, woof. I do hope that dog is for sale. Oh, I almost threw that one away. This would, those would be really cute, fussy cut. Hmm. Yeah, I think that's going to do it. I have lots of little stamps that I can use. Put that page together like that so that it doesn't do that. Do that right now. I seen a lady, I have no clue who I was watching. I seen her do this and then she said, that's the way you get a nice even. You put the glue on and then you fold it, you close the book and it like, then they, then they grip each other the right place or whatever, you know, so that they, so that you're not trying to even it up. You put the glue on, you close the book and then it, and then the pages will attach themselves when you have uh you know the front cover page is kind of like that one was i don't know if you guys got to see how it was i bet you this one's the same way no this one's this one's not i guess i don't get to show you on the back page but it was it didn't open all the way so it would have been kind of weird to okay I don't think you guys want to sit here and watch me gesso all those, although probably one day you will see me gesso all those because I won't ever get around to it. Someone needs to find one of those round to it, so I have it. I'm kidding. Don't send me around to it. I used to have one. I don't, I don't even know where I put that. I must have got around to it and threw it away. So I have this lavender that I bought. 
this out. And this is so pretty and it's gonna go so nice in this book. This turned out, this we did yesterday, turned out so nice. We'll see, there's some of you back yesterday. It's fine. So I have this in my basket. What about a terrarium? For Oren? Yeah. What's he put in there? Bugs? You put, you, you decorate it, put sand, you put plant. But probably like that. You probably like that. And it glows in the dark. Yeah, it's very crafty, artsy. He would he would probably like that. I have some. And then what about this one too? This rock one. Not that one already. We need to do, we'll try to do another one of these before. Oh, paint and rocks, nah. We'll just go get rocks. He and I are gonna just go get rocks and paint some rocks. We don't need a, we don't need no thinking. Just get some pictures. Ideas. We can get ideas out of our head. We're both very creative. We don't, we don't need no stinking book to tell us what we can put on a piece of paper. We don't need no stinking book. You see, I need like a sink. The glass. Yeah, I think that's good. I think that's a good one. That's a good choice. Okay. Nothing. Where was that? I think it was just go where I originally. Why do I? Why do you guys let me do that? I split through 15 pages to end up on the page I started with. All the time. All the time. All the time that happens. Do I ask anybody what's going on this weekend? Any big plans? Any big plans for the weekend? Janie's going to clean, get her area cleaned up so that they can build a wall, lock her in, keep her away. They finally realize they got to keep her locked up. Right, Janie? Keep you locked up. Becca, I just posted in your group under. Oh, excellent. Okay, good, good, good. All right, I will have it there. Again, don't, I, I'm really bad about mailing stuff. It's really not the best advertisement when I try to do swaps. And I've only done one swap and it wasn't too bad. It wasn't too bad about getting them out.
Ringing. Wonder what's that all about? Someone probably talking bad about me. Actual code. I don't code. Only I care about what me, me myself and I. Doom, doom. Me myself and I. That's really weird though. I hear doom. It's like not a ringing, it's like a church bell. I have a church bell going off in my ear. Must be talking really bad about me. <laughs> I lost everybody to all the sales. Oh, the sales, because there is nothing that is going to be in my way on the floor when I'm organized. Uh-huh, sure, sure. Uh-huh, nothing ever will be on the floor, right, Janie? Mm-hmm, me too. Because I'm in a wheelchair, so nothing can be in the floor to block me. Yeah, right. <laughs> I try, I try, I try. texture but sometimes it just I don't like it bubbled. You get some scissors to have cut off. Go up to a ponytail in front of your face and cut. Well, it has nothing. You don't have to cut straight. You pull it up to the front of your face, put a ponytail, and then about two inches farther, put another ponytail, and just cut. It doesn't have to be straight. Because it kind of gives you layers. Works good. I've done it a couple times. I have, I have, I have. Okay. Straight like not do either.
bring some. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got over here. Let's put these over here. Little butterfly, I can hang out with these butterflies. Butterfly, 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 butterfly in the sky. Do do do. Butterfly, butterfly, keep flying in the sky. I don't care what's going on in the world, and that you don't live very long because you're a butterfly. What is the life? expectancy of a butterfly. I'm sure it's different by species. And once they come out of that cocoon, right? What do we got? How long do they got to live and enjoy their life as a butterfly? They probably the life of a caterpillar is probably longer. They gotta eat all that food to get all that energy up to transform into this thing that flies. I wonder what the mission is. What's your mission, butterfly? Eat bugs? Butterflies eat bugs? And then moss eat plants. I suppose some butterflies eat plants too. They all do. Changed your picture again. Showing bells. I can't, it's too dark. I can't see. It looks like red on my screen. Looks kind of red. right now what's on it? I don't know. It's, it looks red to me. It's on my screen, I can't tell. Yeah, it's some sort of red something. Some, whatever it is, it's not very, very visual. I can't see it. <laughs> it's too, the background's too dark no matter what it is, whether it's an old picture or a new picture.
aku apa ya? Very interesting. What are you up to, Shan? Well, I'm going to bed. Do you need something before I go to sleep? No. Uh -uh. I'm going to go sleep before a big party tonight. Partying with the kids. Jughead, you can come say hi. Come on, Jug. You haven't said hi to the ladies. Hey, All right, Dom, I'll see you later, hon. You know, he is interested in my food. It's mom got food, Joe. Mom got food. Begging. Hey, that's not nice. He's like, hey, I didn't cook one after those deer, Mom. I should get something for that. I already gave him my bread. Off of my kawanji. I didn't give him bread. Just a side piece, you know. I spend all that money so that he doesn't get grain and you get him bread. Different than grain. It's processed. This is the small piece. The kitty cat's bread Christmas present should be coming today. Oh, you got one. Mm -hmm. I want to get a storm that snake. Did you see it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Where is it? Was it like remote? Is it like remote or something? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> <It's smooth. laughs> 24 hours of staying away because it's a little more time. It's not remote, so maybe battery operated. I'm bringing them in different colors. And what it is made when it comes in? Uh huh. I got this for $11 on Amazon. Because I blew up my other one too, my, my hair dryer and my other heat gun in the same day. Working in this book. It looks like a pretty high tech gadget. It's like a heat, it's a heat gun. Just like a hair dryer, except this will melt your hair if you put it on too long. It's got an orange tip. Comes with an extra one too, I guess, if it melts. Oh, that's nice of them. Okay, sure. Mm -hmm. That should tell you that it's probably going to melt. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe. We're going to send you an extra heat tip. I know. All right, guys, I'm going to let you go for the day. I will see you guys on um, Monday, 10 a.m. Central Standard Time. I think I'm going to uh, go ahead and just some of this. But uh, I will see you guys uh, next week. Have a beautiful weekend. I love you all. Thank you so much for hanging out. Uh, have a good one, guys. Keep spreading love. Bye.